All right, since I've been playing nothing, basically, but Yakuza for the past month, uh, I decided I might as well do go away. Might as well, uh, it's my dog whining at me. <clears throat> I'm going to take a little break from Yakuza for a little bit and uh, play Catherine. That's another Atlas game. I mean, Persona is like my bread and butter. Like, I know a lot about that series from Persona 2 to Persona 5, of course, because I'm not a fan of Persona 1. But, uh... <clears throat> so we're going to go ahead and play Catherine. I'm not, I have not played very much of this. I just know what the basic plot is. Yeah, I just know the basic plot of this game. I'm by no means an expert on the lore of Catherine, apart from there, I know there's a... Enjoy the sto in enjoy the story by taking control of our tormented main character and guiding him to freedom. Enjoy difficult challenges. Change ver battle and on um, I'll just do the story. Enjoy the start from the beginning of the story. Simple nightmares will haunt our protagonist. Choose this if you'd like to play at a real peaceful nightmare. I'll just do my card. Frightening nightmares will haunt simple nightmares. Okay. Well, in this mode, all blocks will be the usual size. Recommended for those looking for traditional gameplay. In this mode, unusually shaped blocks will appear in the puzzles. Recommended for those looking for a fresh experience. I guess I'll put in this mode, all blocks will be the usual size. Yeah. Recommended for those look very well. Please enjoy the world of Catherine Full Body in comfort. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I've played maybe a minute of the game. And this is on PS3, so I don't know very much about this one. I know that Vincent is a dude who has nightmares. And it's taught and a love triangle between himself and his girlfriend, Catherine. And a succubus named Catherine. So that's all I know about it. I know this one has a third option called Catherine. Oh, she's but aside from that, I'm... That's all I know about this. <laughs> I'm drawing a blank here, everybody. Full-bodied wine is the best. Oh dear. <laughs> when the night sky fills with glamour, a lovely story awaits you. Good evening. Welcome to the Golden Playhouse special feature. Do I see some new faces? Once again, your guide for the night is me, the Midnight Venus, Trisha. Have you heard about this scary rumor? They say if you fall in a dream and don't wake up before you land, you die in real life. Tonight's story is Catherine Full Body, the second coming of an unconventional romantic horror. A man with a certain curse has a terrifying and dramatic week. Oh, does that sound familiar? <laughs> well, like I said, this is Catherine, but with a fuller body. It's aged nicely, with a sensual flavor, not unlike a fine wine. Our hero in this story is Vincent Brooks, age 32. He is an earnest and kind man. But one day we begin to see him have terrifying nightmares. Amidst the storm of temptations around him, he has another chance encounter. And an awfully cute one at that. But doesn't this seem a little... <laughs> convenient? Oh my, sounds like a recipe for disaster. Will Vincent be able to overcome the massive blocks in his life? Perhaps he'll take a road less traveled. <coughs> Excuse me. 
His outcome depends on you, viewers. Sorry to keep you waiting. Raise the curtains. It's time to savor the marriage of pleasure and pain. Now enjoy the show until we meet again. Story is key to op opening up the world. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's what the channel logo is. Huh? I hope it's still Troy Baker, but they might have replaced him. Usually, um... <coughs> I think this is around the time Troy Baker was, like, shifting from Japanese video games to U.S. stuff. So a couple of his roles were given to Matt Mercer. <laughs> or they, oh, it is still him. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit! Whoa! about this is it's basically a visual novel with what? kind of other songs. and start climbing. If you fall, you're dead. I'll die! You fucking serious? There's no time limit on easy difficulty, so the ground below will not fall. Oh. You have plenty of time to think about your next move. All right. Move the blocks to make a path. You can climb one block at a time, right? How am I supposed to move these things? You can grab onto a block with the X button and move it with the directional buttons. Some blocks can be moved, while others cannot. So be sure to experiment. If you make a mistake moving a block, you can press the L1 button to undo it. Okay. Moreover, on easy difficulty, 
You can use autoplay to climb automatically. If you can't figure out how to proceed, press the R1 button to enable autoplay. Oh, that sounds like a... The autoplay feature automatically takes you from the starting point to the goal. You can regain control whenever you want. No, I'm not going to do that. Undo. Edge. All right. All right. All right, I got it. Oh, hey, man. All right, I got it. All right. Even if a block has nothing directly under it, as long as it's touching an edge of another block, it won't fall down. Connecting blocks at their edges to make stairs is the key to successfully scaling the tower. Strive for the goal by creating a path step by step. All right, I got it. Edge. Edge. All right. I got it. Where is this? What is this ringing? If we both make it out of here alive, we'll meet again. Hey, hey, wait a sec. When you hear the bell ringing, you'll know that you've almost reached the goal. Refer to the map located on the left side of the screen to see how much further you have to go. Can get out through here. I missed some extra money, but that's all right. escape from the reborn underground cemetery now a new game is about to begin i'll be sure to prepare something extra special for you behind the next door let's meet again tomorrow night i look forward to it mm. sounds like teddy i know it's not the same actor <laughs> Finally, a Japanese game where I don't play the high school student. 
Uh, hello? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll be in today's code review meeting. Really? No, no, I'm just, uh, just a little under the weather. No, no, it's okay. I'll be right there. Yeah. Um, sorry. Ugh. Listening? Uh, sure. You know, you've been a little out of it lately. Is everything all right? You've been spacing out left and right. Oh, sorry. I uh, had to work early this morning. <laughs> so, are you getting anything extra for this? For what? For all this overtime you're doing. Oh, uh, not this time. This time? Do you usually get overtime pay? Well, no, but... So you don't get anything? <sighs> uh. Here, two sugars. Hey, Catherine. Have you ever had a dream where you died? You mean like... Where you're in danger? No. No, where you actually die. You're being killed or something. No. I usually do the killing in my dreams. Huh? <laughs> yeah, that sounds like you. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Hey, how many years have we been together? Huh? How many years? I'm asking you. It's just, my mother's been calling me up and asking how we're doing. Oh. She's worried about me. She knows I've got a career that keeps me busy, but... Yeah. I mean, it's easy to keep things like they are now, but... I don't know. Sometimes easy's best, right? I mean, who knows what'll happen in the future? I suppose. In other news, we have more on the recent string of unexplained deaths that seem to be exclusively involving young men. Cause of death is unknown, and while police are investigating accidental causes, foul play has apparently not been ruled Hey, out. change it! The Chief match is on! Oh, two beers over here! Coming! Catherine keeps telling me how her mother is constantly calling her. She says she's not worried about it, though. totally gonna take it, right, Vinny? And what do you think? So? Who are you betting on? Come on, pick one. You kidding? Women's wrestling? What'd I know? Sounds to me like she finally wants you to tie the knot. Uh, you think so too? What else could it mean? I've known you since we were kids, but... Wow, you, married, huh? Hey, nothing's set in stone yet. What, you don't want to marry your girlfriend? It's not that. I, mean, I love her, but I don't think we need to run out and get married. You know, it's, it's like we're comfortable where we are. Are you? Yeah, that's what she said. Her job's always most important to her. I mean, you know she's always been the ambitious type, right? It doesn't mean she'll always be like that. That's not what I mean. Besides, you're single too. Hey, I'm still looking for my soulmate. <laughs> I'm not like you. I've already told my girl that I'm not interested in marrying her. What if you never meet your soulmate? Then I'll never get married. So what? That sounds just like you, Chief. Oh, 
How'd the interview go? <laughs> the boss seems like a really nice person. He said I could work here starting tomorrow. So everything's cool with you now? Mm-hmm. Way better. Hey, did old boss make any weird moves? Hey, Rin, come here. Uh, I'll see you later. Anyway, did you hear about Paul? He's dead. Paul? Wait, that Paul? He's dead? Yeah, I heard he just got divorced, but he looked healthy. It's a complete shock. What happened to him? An accident? I don't know. Apparently his mother just found him dead in his room this morning. This morning? Wait, you mean... Yeah, the mystery death on the news? That was him. Holy shit, no way! Maybe we'll all wind up dead tomorrow too. Shut the hell up. Man, I hate the news. They're always trying to push their agenda for ratings. Toby, you are really easy to mess with. <laughs> well, speaking of crazy stuff this morning, I pissed the bed for the first time since grade school. What? Oh, that's messed up, man. <laughs> I had a really scary dream, but I don't remember what it was about. Oh, man. How old are you? 32. I know that. You know, I don't think I need to hear this. Shut up. I was really fucking scared, all right? Oh, where are you guys going? Stick around. I, I don't want to go home just yet. So, why don't you have Catherine meet you here? No, I just saw her today. Besides, she'd get mad at me if I told her. Ah, jeez. What does she see in this poor fool? Sorry, but I gotta be in early tomorrow. Don't drink too much, okay? All right. Take care, Vince. See you later. Mm, see ya. She managed to get the job, huh? Of course. I can't just abandon someone with amnesia, especially when they seem like such a good kid. And like Johnny said, there's this innocent cluelessness to Rin that oh, I just can't help caring about. Not to mention the whole stalker thing. Who would do that and why? Seems like even she doesn't know. Now how could that be? You should find out. okay now yeah I think so I wanted to say thanks not just for saving me but also for finding me a job and a place to stay I was so scared I couldn't remember anything I'm so glad I met someone as nice as you Vincent ah, it's nothing really anyone would have done the same still you saved me Vincent I start working here tomorrow so I'll do my best to show you my appreciation texts at the bar. You can respond to some of them. Give it a try.
certain words and actions change Vincent's inner ideas, a meter will be shown. Vincent's words and actions will affect the story. Remember it. we've been together marriage huh figure this would happen eventually but just change jobs I don't want to give her trouble <sighs> bringing up her parents out of the blue it's not like her you got a mail Again. Jesus Christ. Hello, Vincent. It's me. Yeah, what's up? I wanted to apologize for cutting our meeting short this morning. Oh, that. What do you mean, that? Wasn't it important to you? Uh, that's not what I meant. Whatever. I wasted my time calling you. Good night. Don't stay out too late drinking. Okay, yeah, if I was Vincent, I wouldn't marry you either if you had to get off the phone with me like that. Ah, uh, it's late. It's kind of rude. Would you like to save your progress? My contacts moved my eye, but there we go. Fixed it. So, you've met some new faces. That poor lost soul is particularly intriguing. You'll find there are many lost what sheep in the, world? in the prison of despair. <laughs> are those all my, are those people online? night's dream again what the hell i was at the bar and this girl came in and then damn it, i can't remember what's going on oh this is where somebody died i guess what you're the new guy from last night voice you're that guy from yesterday 
have unique characteristics, such as cracked blocks and immovable blocks. Whenever you see a new block, proceed with... down to the edge okay. whenever you run out of footing while dragging a block. By crawling along those edges, you may be able to reach areas that couldn't be accessed on foot. All right. All right, I got it. All right. All right, I got it. I see you're still alive and kicking. If you can't see ahead of you, try looking around. Even without dragging a block, you can easily hang down by running off a ledge where there is no step down. This technique is vital to your success. Okay. Be sure to get comfortable with it. <laughs> All right, I got it. Doing, bro? Picking up a mystic pillow will grant you an additional undo until you reach the goal. Gather as many as you can. It's ringing! We're gonna get out of here! to try and undo things. You've come pretty far. Good job. I'll see you at the landing. Everybody else is there too. Who's everyone? Hey, hey, wait a sec. Once you've crossed a checkpoint, you can retry from that spot. Be sure to run through it whenever you see one. Looks like you survived. Who, who are you? A sheep? Do I look like a sheep? You're the sheep. Everybody hears the sheep, but me. Mm. I recognize that voice. Who are you? Where the hell is this place? Wish I knew. One thing's for certain, though. If we don't run, we're going to be killed. Killed? If you see this place once, it's all over. You'll keep coming back every night. Every night? You're kidding me. We all have the same fate here. If you don't want to die, you've got to climb. So if I climb, I'll be saved? There's no guarantee. But take a look at that. See that bell? It's like a church or something. A church? If we can reach the top, there may be a way to escape. So there is a way out. Like I said, 
There's no guarantee, but we've got to believe. It keeps us sane. Those who panic die first. Just quit with all the dying stuff. I I'll do whatever you say. Just, just help me. Look, from here on out, I'm afraid you're on your own. I'm going now. No, 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 wait. You hurry too. Hey, hey, hey! You can't be serious. You can save in the notebook and talk with other sheep on the landings. Talk to other sheep on land. Go on, talk to them. When the icon is pink, you can talk to them. It grays out once they have nothing more to say. steps you mean to climb up. You'll have the support you need to reach higher and higher, like a pyramid. Remember this basic technique. What do you think? Nice. Mm, I think that might be tough by itself. Can Allow me to explain the slider. Pull out two blocks vertically, then slide the bottom one over. Remember this basic mm. action, which utilizes the properties of edges. Since edges connect, you can make a stairway, even in tight spots. Oh, you're a genius. How was that? Um, uh, well... Anyway, what I want to say is this. If you're relying on luck to keep you alive, then it's all over. I know. My reporter's instincts are telling me this dangerous form of free climbing has some techniques hidden within it. There are many techniques to discover. I guess the key is to find as many as we can. All right, if you find anything, you tell me, okay? That's an order. You want me to teach you? No, I already I gotta go. Just calm down. Are you saying that to try to break? I'm not falling for that. So Push me too. Everyone's just out. <laughs> Where am I? What's with all these damn sheep? That's all I want to know. Can you tell me anything? <laughs> they told me to go up. But what's up there? <laughs> Give me a break. Yeah. I'll have to use that next time. Virtuous, however, to be concerned about someone other than yourself, given our present circumstances. I'm going to reward you with an oil. An oil? Ah, are you? <laughs> what? What is this place? Why was I taken here? Same here. Wish I knew. What are those cages? Why are there sheep? I've had it. Get me out of here. Someone in there, right? Why don't you take a seat? Oh, hey, long time no see. Or rather, nice to see you here. And welcome to the confessional. Who are you? 
This is the world of nightmares. I guess you could call me its supervisor. I sense a force of change rising up. What exactly happened in the other world? I guess it doesn't matter. You lambs are all destined to die here anyway. What? Are you ridiculous? But before I kill you, I want to determine the value of your life. So you'll have to answer some questions. Question one. What expectations do you have for your significant other? Pull the rope with the answer that best matches your true feelings. Oh, so this is not. <laughs> Oh, well, it changes the thing. Oh, so that's your choice. Well, I guess everybody's different. Hey, who are you? Are you doing all this? I told you. I'm just the supervisor. Someone else brought you here. It's someone you know. <sighs> you never know what people are actually thinking. To learn the truth, you must survive. Then you can think about what's going on here. Let's head to the next trial. Still more? Commencing area two. Are you ready? All right, I got it. Strange items. Strange items? I don't know what you're talking about. Well, you can only carry one item at a time. But each, don't worry about using an item at the wrong time. If you, right. like when you use a white block, a 3x3 three three platform will... This enables you to create footing even in tight spaces. Drop down to get that. Are you having some trouble? Remember, you can always go back and undo some of your moves. All right, I got it. Or not to. All right, I got it. Best to try and undo your moves. Try and undo your moves. All right. Edge. All right. Whoa. Bring it. Whoa. Get out of here. You got it. I've seen others here and there. The fighting's going to start getting fierce. This is a dog eat dog world. There's no time for courtesy. Anyway, no matter what pops up, stay calm and keep climbing. What the hell is this place? I don't know. I got it. All right. All right, I got it. Oh, hang on. Edge. 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 
Survived. It's you. Looks like you're still alive. Is that you? You're safe too. Barely. Still. How many people died trying to come here? People? I don't... Listen. Here, you see everybody else as sheep. But all these sheep, they're really human. There's got to be some reason why we were all brought here. What reason could there be? Why do we have to suffer like this? Who knows? But I do have an idea. An idea? Let's stop the speculation. It's just going to confuse us more. <sighs> you should think of what to do next. I'm hearing rumors of something big coming soon. You be careful now. Something big? Still, you're really getting the hang of things. There's nothing more I can teach you. That can't be true. Come on, you gotta have something you can tell me. If we're lucky, we'll meet again. Uh, hey, wait! Uh, right. At the landings, you can learn tips on how to climb. Tips on how to climb. Moving blocks around mindlessly won't work. New techniques will be written down by the other sheep. Oh, that's not cool. I found this out just now. Yeah, I'm enjoying this. This is fun. Yo, have we met before? You survived because of the techniques I found, huh? Well, tell me something. Let me show you another great technique. Allow me to explain suspending. This technique gives you more room to maneuver. Push a block off a ledge with nothing below. As long as the edges connect, the block will remain in place. Okay. That? I'm a regular blockologist, huh? Hmm, that's a good start. Try to remember this one, too. Allow me to explain pullback. If you climb up and find yourself stuck, Try pulling a block and backing down. By creating a stairway as you go down, you will be able to go higher than you could before. Okay. That's crazy. You knew that? Um, what? Okay, if you find any new moves, you come straight to me. This is coming from the executive manager. I'll write down any techniques I discover. I recommend reading them from time to time. <laughs> Snap out of it. There's nothing like that anywhere near the monster talks. Oh, huh? oh cause they all think they're sheep. Or everyone else is a sheep when I'm yeah. What's with all the cubes? I don't understand any of this. What should I do? Please help me. You just gotta climb. Learn the techniques. Like what? Allow me to explain the tornado. If blocks are stacked all over the place. Calm down, and pull them out one by one. Move them aside, and bring them down, then make a staircase and climb. Whoa, is that how you climb? Wow, you're amazing. I saw a sheep fall past me on my way up. I, I can't get that scream out of my head. All you'll hear is your own death scream. You can stay here, but even this place will fall eventually. about that technique you showed me so I won't forget. 
the technique we're like. Allow me to explain. If blocks are stacked all over, move them aside. Then. Think I'm gonna keep. Okay. I told you. Well, don't be an asshole about it. You're here, Lost Land. Next question. I've had enough of this. A man's worth kept not to mention. You have more than... This is the... Does life begin? <laughs> You've made your selection. I knew it! This is actually a giant chat. Wait, so does that mean there's a... The world is in a state of flux. I won't be... Be careful what you take for granted. Something big is coming. I can feel it. Something the likes of which this world has never seen. <sighs> I guess there's no point in worrying about the future. <laughs> I like that laugh. What's with that? Okay, here we go. Next one. <laughs> Escape. Huh? What? That voice? Where have I? I won't let you escape. What the hell is this? Catherine? The fists of grudge have appeared. It's the killer. Do not die. Alright, I got it. Alright, I got it. Alright, I got it. All right, I got it. When you use a bell, all nearby blocks will be converted into. This is handy for getting rid of tricky obstacles. Edge. All right, I got it. How's Edge. this? I'll take this. All right, I got it. Find a way forward. You may wish to undo and try a new strategy. I'm gonna uh, skip this one. All right, all right, I got it. All right, all right, I got it. Oh, I can move those. Oh, oh. 
Is it gone? I'm saved, right? Yeah! Congratulations! Amazing climbing! The prison of despair could not hold you. As promised, I have something special to show you tonight. Think back to long ago. Back to a time when you felt happy. Sorry about today. I don't usually burn the bacon like that. It's all right. I don't mind it a little crispy. I can tell something's going on with you. You working too hard? <laughs> no, I'm fine. You've been gaining weight, haven't you? Can't forget to eat your veggies. Well, I put ketchup on almost everything. <laughs> that doesn't count. You know what? <laughs> Ow. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Maybe a little workout will burn out those extra calories. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? Fond memories, huh? You should think long and hard about what you have to lose. Let's do this again tomorrow. If you can survive, that is. <laughs> Marriage is just a tradition, right? Seriously, who wants to be tied down? As long as two people are together, it's okay, right? It's supposed to be free, don't you think? Kind of surprising. Hmm? You know how it is with most girls. As soon as they're adults, all they can think about is tying the knot, right? But there are girls like you out there. <laughs> Never knew. Oh, it's not that strange, is it? Men aren't the only ones who fear being chained down. I'll remember that. Thank goodness. Huh? We think alike. Whoa! tomorrow so I need to get home oh, mm. oh, I had fun tonight oh, oh. you must like what you see <laughs> I'm not staring you're a bad liar <laughs> you taste like smoke <laughs> but I don't mind <laughs> you don't say Oh man, this is not good. Hmm? 
what isn't good? Well, uh, you know, hooking up after we just met. Jeez, what the hell am I saying? Hmm. Huh? Um, is this gonna be a problem? So, hey, I cheated on Catherine. This is bad. This is really, really bad. But I didn't make a move. She forced herself on me. Oh, fuck, man. I drank way too much. Ha <laughs> Uh, would you mind not staring at me like that? It's kind of creepy. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Listen, I don't want you to get the wrong idea, okay? I don't just sleep around. Ow. I came here because I like you. Ah, no. Shh. No. So, how do you feel about me? Huh? Oh, wow. Um, I can't quite explain it. Uh, I feel odd. Hmm? You see, this is my first time. Oh, wow. I can't believe it. And I am really screwing this up right now. So then, it was love at first sight? Huh? Ah! What? I'm sorry. I'm really... You said you have to work, right? Work? Uh, I guess... Sorry! I, uh, I gotta go now. I have a, um, a dentist appointment now. Dentist? Yeah, dentists get angry if you're late, too. They don't get angry if you're late, they just skip to the next person a month ahead of you. I guess they'll have to wait until next time. <laughs> okay, see you soon. Hey, wait! I'm actually dating someone. <sighs> this is a mistake. A mistake. It's gotta be a mistake. That's Duke saying, huh? Hi, Duke. Ah, you know what? It just hit me. It's Liam O'Brien. You know how they say every guy has three hot streaks with the ladies in his life? This is your third. Hot streaks? Well, when the hell were the other two? When we were kids, you're the most popular with the girls. <laughs> I don't remember that. The second time you were in the zone was when you started dating Catherine. Although, uh, that's over if she finds out about this. <sighs> Crap, man. She's probably gonna kill me. That's what you're all scared about. As long as she doesn't find out, you're safe, right? Just act like it never happened. I'm not like you. I can't just ignore this. Well then, why not switch it up? That way you won't hear any more marriage talk, right? All that stuff about soulmates and eternal love is bullshit. Married life sucks, man. You really want to go through the same shit I have? I'm not like you. I don't want to sleep around. I just want life to stay the same. <sighs> what am I going to do? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Uh, if you're going to whine, you shouldn't have done it, dumbass. Well, no shit. I wish I could just live all carefree like you. Don't you realize there's nothing you can do, you schmuck? No matter how good you are to a woman, you never know if she'll stab you in the back. <sighs> Well, if you're gonna ditch the new girl, hook me up. She's cute, right? You got a picture of her? Nice. No, I don't have her pic. She's not your type, anyway. Come on, how do you know that? Because she's my type. Oh. <sighs> I'm so fucked. Hey, have you heard the rumor about the dream where you're falling? Huh? Who cares? Come on, if you fall and die in the dream, you'll die in real life. My friend's boyfriend almost died. Isn't that scary? Huh? How do you know? Were you able to see his dream? Hey, you all right, man? You don't look so hot. Uh, I guess I didn't really get much sleep last night. Obviously. Anyway, you're way too freaked out over a one-night stand. Hey, you paying attention? Listen, man. Huh. I never saw the girl. Oh, really? I figured one of you guys told her to sit with me. 
Uh, if this girl was cute, you'd definitely remember. You know, I gotta say, because of you jerks, I never get a chance to date anyone. If I was a ladies' man, I wouldn't be here every night with you guys. Anyway, you dig the older chicks, don't you? Yeah, I want a woman who's, you know, mature, stern, has a nice pair of heels. Whoa, man. I'm like that creepy guy in horror movies who tries too hard to be noticed. Shut up! I'm not like that! What's wrong with, you know, having some adult fun with someone older than I am? Hmm. So, did I hear someone call for me? Oh, hey, Erica! I've got a nice pair of stiletto heels I know how to use. Whoa, Erica. Okay, enough of that. So have you guys heard about the woman's wrath? They say it targets cheating men and kills them, or not. Which is it? Wait, 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 what? What exactly is this woman's wrath? Oh, you don't need to worry about it. You only care about your girl, Vincent. Oh, what are you talking about? This guy totally needs to know. Cheating is pathetic. I agree with Toby. Pathetic. Who are you calling pathetic? Shut up and eat your peanuts. Ow, my eye! Huh? What? You're cheating. Weren't you talking about marriage? Why don't you say it louder? Seriously, stop yelling about cheating and shit. I, I think someone on Mars didn't quite hear you. Oh, that's low, Vincent. Lowest of the low. Don't call me that. Now you know. Just leave me alone. Well, well, come on. Tell me about this girl. Oh, God. Apparently, she's destiny level cute. Cut that shit out. Are you kidding? Finding your soulmate is awesome. I'm totally jealous. You jackasses better not mention this to anyone outside the bar. I am serious. Dude, we know the drill. Say, have you heard? It seems that Boss was a bit of a player back in the day and broke more than his share of hearts. You see how he's wearing those tacky sunglasses indoors? They say he's using those to hide his face. <laughs> yeah, right. You're in hot water yourself, right? Maybe you should invest in some shades. Ha, ha, ha. Shut up. I'm done fooling around. Oh, by the way, Rin's gonna play the piano here, starting today. That? Okay. Hello. Do you know where you are? Okay. Never mind that. Uh, how about a name? Uh, uh, Rin. Rin? Uh, that's a nice name. Uh, who is that, though? What was that? The amateur hour. Oh, don't say that. Rin's working really hard. Uh, Vincent? What did you think of my performance? Oh, it was, uh, great. Yeah, it was great. Really, uh, unique. Thank you so much. I was hoping to play a little better than that, but... Don't worry about it. No one gets things perfect the first time around. I guess you're right. I'll have to keep practicing. Yeah, if the bar doesn't go out of business by then. God! Well, I'll see you later. See ya. <laughs> well, nobody's perfect. I mean, <laughs> if she's that cute, who cares, right? <laughs> <sighs> What's up with you anyway? 
Saving some cute girl from a stalker in the streets? Sounds like a daytime soap opera. That stuff doesn't really happen. Well, it did, so give it a rest. Does that girl really have amnesia? Erica, you took her to the doctor, right? Did they find anything? Not really. They think it's only temporary. But it must be hard when the only thing you remember is wanting to play piano. Hey, so are you two really neighbors now? Yeah, the last guy just happened to move out. You better keep your hands off her. <laughs> oh, shut up. It's not like that. I, I'm an old man over here. <sighs> but you guys really came through for us. You know it. Having Rin work here was a great idea, huh? We have you guys and even a police officer as customers. Not to mention, public spaces are a lot safer if she's really being stalked by someone. Yeah. Spend some time at the bar. You can drink by pressing the square button or get up by pressing the circle button. You can open menus with the... You can change the puzzle type and difficulty of the game in... If I took a shot every time she hit a wrong note... That's a deal breaker for me. No matter how you and Catherine have been together a long time, right? What was it like in the beginning? I just, uh, it wasn't anything special. It was at the reunion. He was giving her dating advice. Then he ended up falling for her himself. He ran to her side in the middle of the night when she was depressed. Huh? Hey, stop that. Stand up guy like that turns out. <laughs> oh. You can raise your intoxication level up to three times. How drunk Vincent gets corresponds to how fast he moves that night in his night. Shit. I've never cheated in my life. Ren's gonna be fine. What about you, though? That thing about men who cheat being cursed? You mean, like how Paul died? Yeah. Or it is. This is getting called the woman. <laughs> Sounds like something. Hey, Paul's been here a few times. Yeah. He was a classmate of all. I ran into him just... Seriously? How was he? We just traded greetings, but he looked fine. Hey, it's not your fault. Hmm? Yeah, I get it. You got a mail. You can take your phone out to check it by pressing the... You can also save image... That's it for now, I guess. I don't know if I play like it. Um, I don't, if I go back to this, I don't know. It's kind of, I, I don't know if that is really. But, um, yeah. Well, have a good day. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.